everybody, welcome to Joe's Kitchen Capers. I've got a top tip for you today, and that is how to streamline my spirulina smoothie. If you saw my original recipe, you might have thought, whoa, that has got far too many ingredients and you mightn't even want to be bothered to get all that stuff out of the cupboard. So I want to show you how I do it, and I've got all my ingredients out here. I've got an empty jar which has got my spirulina label on and let me show you what we're going to do. I'm going to make enough here for about 10 smoothies. And here we go. First of all, I've got my gelatine. Now if you want to know any of the tips about what these ingredients do for you, I'll put a list below so you can check it out. And I'm going to measure in that six. So there's 10 tablespoons of gelatine in there. Then I'm going to move on to my chia seeds and put the same amount in. Onto our alise. Now alise is really easy to make instead of buying it. So if you are making it, just make sure you grind up your linseeds first because they're a lot harder seed and then add your sunflowers and your almonds for a quick chop afterwards. So 10 of alise again. Onto my goji berries, another great superfood. Now the kamu kamu. I'm just going to put a couple of tablespoons of that in. We're not going to put 10 of those. This is a really fantastic vitamin C boost. And then we've got the acai, which I've only got a little bit left of that, so I might just tip. So it's probably a couple of tablespoons there. And then lastly, the star, which is our spirulina. So another 10 of those. I've made the spirulina a bit, bit of a heat spoon. Might put an extra one of those in for good luck. Lid goes on. Give it a good shake up to combine everything. And there you've got your spirulina mix, which you can add straight to your smoothie. Blend it up in your blender and have a look at this to make it even easier. And in here, I've got my little packs all ready with my avocado, my berries, and my banana. They're ready to go straight into my smoothie. So then we've made it three simple steps. You've got your berries, your little bag with your berries, avocado, and banana. Add my spirulina mix and some coconut water, and you're away laughing. One spirulina smoothie full of goodness ready to go.